Hi, my crafty friends. How you all doing? It's been a long time since I've seen you. It's been since yesterday. No. <laughs> Thanks for coming to my channel. I hope I pulled everything for Saturday mornings created by our Jill Norwood. And um, I made some cards. And... I want to show you what I used, and I'm thinking, have I pulled everything that I used? Well, we'll see. Okay, I used this sponge sugar distress ink. I used Memento Ladybug. That was my nickname when I was still a flower child 100,000 years ago. I used Sunflower by Archival Ink. Did I? Did I? Yeah. And I used the Distress Ink. The tea stain. Tea dye. Tea dye. Okay, these are the images I used. I'm so forgetful. I'm so bad. I used this little critter. You all know by now, I am just attracted to little animals. I Baby animals, and so I just love them. I used this little mouse from, oh, this is a Darcy. And the number is right here, if you're interested. This is a Hero Arts, and I got this at Hobby Lobby. I, I, this little mouse. I used, again, the peachy keen stamp and this time i used the little valentine's boy i used what has become fast my favorite dye anna white's what's it called crazy stitched dye love it love it love it and the number is right here it's an impression obsession dye <clears throat> i used uh this die and uh, this one and that's uh aliexpress i think no it's a sissix it comes with this it's a sissix die and i use this because of a mistake i'll, sh I'll show you and i use this hard die and that's by aliexpress now i'm hoping and praying that uh, other than papers that I hope I pulled everything. Okay. This is a very girly, girly, girly dye for my granddaughter, uh, Madison. She's very, very girly, girly. And this is the little Darcy stamp. And these little hearts came out of these little hearts. And there's the phrase... And there's where I used the spun sugar. And this is the inside. It's very simple because she's a teenager. Well, yeah, she's just gonna look at it and in a day or two, ditch it. I did a lot of the hearts, but hey, it's girly girly. All you need is love, but a little cupcake now and then doesn't hurt. <laughs> That's cute. And I used, uh, yeah, I did forget to pull something, but what else is new? You remember I used this one yesterday, too, that little stamp I found at the flea market. And this is the little peachy keen boy dye. And this is the happy valentines that I found in my stash and a little wooden button. And I gave him some cheeks. And again, I, did I show this yesterday? Did I show this yesterday? You all tell me. I might have to look back. I did show this yesterday, didn't I? Yeah, forget it. <laughs> oh, my God. This is what you get. I have the attention span of a gnat. Okay, this one is that little mouse. And I hope I did. See the little mouse? I mean, I don't know my stuff. I hope I got the colors right. I mean, I love little critters, but no, I don't know mouse. I don't want to know a mouse, so I don't know. 
and there I'll use the little yellow button to go. This one I use that sunflower uh, stamp ink ink. And uh, this is sending a tiny hello. Now this I just did the inside in yellow. I know what they're what they are. They're dandelion poofy things, right? But they are. I didn't know what to do with the stems because, you know, the, the uh, so I just left them like they are. Because, I mean, what are you going to do? Oh, and I'm learning how to do the shadows. I don't know how effective I do them, but I am learning how to do the little shadows. So he's not, although he is floating in the air, I really didn't have to do shadows with him. Uh, well, okay. And this is a little tiny card. I enjoy doing tiny cards. And this is the inside. This is the inside of this. I did show you that die, right? Yeah, no, I didn't. <laughs> oh, it's a shaded blossom die. I showed it to you yesterday. And I put it away. But you've seen that die. You've seen me using that die. And then my last card is, this is where I make the mistake. And I used this. And I almost threw the card away because I really, really, really don't like that I had to use that. So I used the bundle girl. I love the little bundle girl. I didn't show her either, did I? Yeah, hold on. I do have to show her to you so you can get the number. If you're interested, this is her. This is the little bundle girl. And the number is right here. So I used a stamp under here and then I realized, oh my God, that's an Easter stamp. I didn't pay attention because it fit perfectly in there, right? So I thought, oh. And it came from one of my cutesy patootsie stamps. And I just thought it was a Valentine's stamp and it was an Easter stamp. So I thought, okay, I'm going to have to throw it away. But I thought, well, let's look if I can find something else. So I found this, like I said, I used this die. And then I put this happy Valentine that I found on my stash. And I used those little, I think they're felt uh, thingies, uh, hearts that I got at Hobby Lobby. But, oh, God, I hate this so much. I hate this part so much. I think I might just redo her. Because, oh, jeez, I just muffed it up. And there I used the uh, cut. This is the shaded blossom dye. And I used, I had left over, a, one of the frames was left over from a, one of the cutouts I did. So I used that, and then I used the little rectangle die. And this is actually a uh, table scatter or, or something like that. It's foiled. I don't know if you can see. And that's the inside. Yeah, I hate this so much. I'm so mad at myself. And then I made more and I'm showing you this because I remembered the ribbon. It is called seam binding. Yesterday, I couldn't remember what the uh, this was called. And I made more because I had six. Now I got five because these are glass. I really wish they were plastic. I dropped one and it was already full. It was a nightmare on my carpet. It was a nightmare. I had to... Vacuum it up and then still pick up pieces and the, the glass was a oh, nightmare. Anyway, I made the other five, uh, but now I got four left. <laughs> no. Yeah, four left because one's going away. So anyway, that's my Saturday morning makes. Uh, I hope you had a great week. Thank you for all my subscribers and coming back to me all the time and being kind and sweet. This is just such a great community. Uh, I love being here. Everybody is... I I feel like everybody is just my personal friend and we've never even met, right? <laughs> but uh, anyway, 
thank you for stopping by. Have a great weekend and a great rest of the week. Be good and kind to each other. Love each other and love and peace. Bye-bye.